Hi guys, my name is Lisa Walford and I'm going to show you another way to go into Shalemba Sarvangasana. The shoulder stand is such a potent posture and it's helpful to have a few ways of exploring it so that whether it's your shoulders or your back or you know your throat, you know, there's different ways that you can experiment and find what works best for you. Oftentimes, particularly men, tend to have kind of thicker shoulders, and this is a really helpful way. Okay. So I have four blankets here and a chair. I'm going to lie down and place my feet up onto the chair and my shoulders on the blanket. Okay. The shoulders a few inches away from the edge of the blanket and the chair where I can hold on to the front legs of the chair. There's probably only two axioms in all of yoga. One is to keep breathing, and the other is to never turn your head and shoulder stand. Okay, so I'm gonna look straight up, roll the inner arm to the outer arm so that the chest broadens, and the muscles in the upper back, the trapezius muscle, firm in toward the shoulder blades. The shoulder blades move up toward the chest. You'll feel that here. Then as I hold the legs of the chair, I'm going to press the shoulder bones and the humerus, this upper arm bone, straight down. The throat soft. Feet on the chair, lift the hips. From here, roll the shoulders under even more. The arms, the arms are externally rotating. Okay, and move, you'll still hold on to the chair, move the middle buttocks up so that the chest, the back of the body, moves to the front of the body, and the chest can really open. This may be fine, just staying here is effective. You can then place your hands onto your back, press the shoulders down, and extend one leg, and extend the other leg. The middle buttocks still move forward, so you form a straight line from the shoulders all the way up to the, to the feet. Okay. And as you lift the body, the arms press firmly down. Okay. Now from here, we're going to take, uh, take one leg slightly forward to counterbalance the opposite leg. As soon as the leg touches the chair, grab the chair and slowly roll all the way down. And lie quietly. You can rest here with your calves on the chair. Okay, and slide off the blanket. Now there's one thing I want to stress, and that is that I have a sticky mat underneath the chair. Okay, so my chair isn't going to slide. Okay, but it might be preferable the first time you do this to take the chair against the wall. Okay, so practice and you'll find a version of shoulder stand that best serves you. See you next time.